Twin River Unified School District families concerned about the lack of middle and high schools in Natomas. This is a good area to raise my children in. I want to be in this area and not have to bus my children outside to go to school. But that's what many parents at Monday night's town hall have been doing. When it's time to choose a junior high, if they can't get into one of the charter schools here in Natomas, then their options are pretty far outside of the area. For middle school, the closest option is Norwood. For high school, it's Grant Union or Rio Linda, adding anywhere from 10 to 20 minutes to a morning commute. As far as I'm concerned, we're in two different communities, so if I'm going to take you over there now, that's a trip. It's exactly the opposite direction of anything that we go to, so yeah, that's a big concern for me. For Jessica and Michael Turner, the town hall left many questions unanswered, specifically when will a new school be built? Right now it's clear as mud. <laughs> um, I'm hoping that, you know, as things develop over the next several years, that things will change. We need to resolve this issue quickly um, before we lose more families out of this beautiful neighborhood. The school district is working with the city of Sacramento on potential school sites, including a K through eight school in the future 3000 home Greenbrier development near the airport, but no specific plans have school board approval. We really want to bring some options into our community. We want to work with Twin Rivers Unified on what that looks like, how we pay for it moving forward. And with the lack of options in the near future, some parents are considering leaving altogether. And everything is, oh, well, in 2021, we're going to have this going. Okay, but I'm one of the people who is affected now.